Across the globe, everyone is realising that you know, space isn't the peaceful, non-congested area that it used to be. There are other countries out there that have capabilities in space or developing capabilities that could hold some of our assets at risk in the future. So bringing like-minded countries together in the one place allows us to use each other's capabilities and each other's knowledge to enhance the ability to actually protect uh, the use of, of space. Here at the CSPOC, we are ultimately responsible for standing watch 24-7. The types of information that we're looking at is what we call Space Situational Awareness, or SSA. And that is an understanding of where things are in the space domain, what they are doing, how the environment is impacting those operations, and ultimately ensuring the, our ability to operate in and through the space domain. The big part is keeping situational awareness of what's happening around the globe um, in the different areas of, of conflict and peacetime so that we can, we can give the right space effects at the right time in the right place uh, so that not only the military can do their job but the, the civilian population have the effects that they need. Around the globe, the common use of space for all mankind, the civilian population is heavily reliant on it. From you know, global positioning systems in, in your car or your Garmin to um, the use of automatic telemachines and hospitals and, and in industry. Um, so without the reliance for the civilian population, we'll pretty much crumble if we, if we lose the effects that we can provide from space. The CSPOC represents the opportunity for us to bring the capabilities that each of these nations has in the space domain, bring that together and bring all of the capabilities together to ensure that we can deliver the right effect at the right place at the right time. The Combined Space Operations Centre will bring like-minded countries together to make sure space in the future is available for use by all countries around the globe, um, provide more support to our warfighters and ensure that the commercial and civil populations around the world have continual use of, of space. I think uh, one of the things that I've learned having worked here at the, the JSPOC now for three years is that this organization is always going to continue to evolve and the CSPOC just represents that next evolution for this organization. Our blue space capabilities continue to evolve and our adversary threat also continues to evolve. Those two things really necessitate the change required in this organization and our constant need to evolve to meet the adversary's threat.